So I met Shania seven years ago in dental assisting school, and originally we did not start off as friends. But we soon realized that we were way too much alike to not be friends. In school, Shania was either going to be my friend or my enemy because we were so damn competitive. We got that sunrise, apple pies, won't sleep tonight, we'll dive into the blue. We got that good rush, young in love, let's turn it up, go round the world with you, round the world with you. <laughs> oh, not Sorry. <laughs> I met Ironman High School. We didn't really start hanging out till like right after, but we clicked immediately, and we loved fast cars and Captain Morgan. Never, never at the same time, but never at the same time. Marriage is of God, and each day you must talk with each other, tell each other I love you, touch each other tantalize each other, but not during a high state football game. Shania and I have only known each other for about two and a half years, but if you'd ask us both, it feels like a lifetime. We have had made a lot of memories within a small amount of time frame, some full of laughs, some that had us in tears, and others that we don't really remember. I felt the world stop turning, I felt the waves come crashing down, I found you. I know you from my memory Was it a past or future life? I know you so I've known Adam since I was in seventh grade. Some of my greatest memories when we first started out, we pretty much TP'd and ding-dong ditched every house in Fairfield County. So I apologize if any of you guys are out there tonight. We probably hit your house. With all seriousness, Shania is one of the most nurturing people I have ever met. She is always making sure everyone is okay and has everything they need before herself. I have no doubt if I called Shania at any given moment that she would drop everything for me. I've watched Adam and Shania grow a lot over the years. One of my favorite things that I have seen is them becoming parents. Having Barrett is one of the best blessings they have ever had. Uh, I love you, man. I uh, appreciate everything you've done for me. And I can't go into any more detail because if I cry, I don't even like crying by myself, let alone in front of a million people. Shania and Adam, I'm so excited for you two. Adam, I especially thank you for finally putting a ring on her finger. Now Adam, from watching OSU games to UFC fights, to taking us boating and chilling by the pool, you're always, always making sure and asking us if we're having fun.
wish you guys a lifetime of happiness. Um, I hope today is everything that you guys dreamed it would be. And let's have a good night. So cheers to Adam and Shania, guys. If everyone could please raise your glass and toast to the new Mr. and Mrs. He Long. I mean, um, sorry, D Long. Congrats, you guys. I wish you guys a happy marriage. And I love you both to death. And thanks for letting me be a big part of one of the biggest days of both of your lives. I can't wait to see what the future holds for you guys. Now that you're finally married, let's cheers to some more babies. Cheers. Martin Luther gives this advice to all husbands and wives. Let the wife make the husband glad to come home and let him make her sorry to see him leave. If both of you could remember the words, I'm sorry, I was wrong, will you please forgive me? Your marriage will stay on the right path. <laughs>